All right, welcome back to Malik Cunningham franchise with the Patriots here on Madden 24. It's been quite a while since I have recorded this franchise series, and uh, apparently last week we lost pretty badly to the Chiefs. I kind of remember that one. Um... It's also week eight, so it is the trade deadline. Um, we also have to set our national scouting focus, um, which we're going to set to corner. Hopefully there's some good ones in this draft. Um I think what I'm going to do as far as the trade deadline here is I guess we'll defend the outside run. Run outside? I really don't want to run outside. I kind of want to throw it deep. Um, as far as the trade deadline, I think I'm going to play the game. And then if we make any moves at the deadline here, we're going to do it. Um, in the next episode, we're just not advanced the week at the end of this episode. Because I have not really. It's been a while since I've played. I haven't really thought about it, anything that I would do at the deadline. So. Could maybe look to trade Jamison Williams. Um, because his contract is going to expire. Um, the problem with that is we actually really need him. <laughs> Let's go now. Ready. Okay, great. On the ready. Well, we've, we've got bronze here, I mean. Would like to at least get silver. But I think I'm just taking too many shots down the field on the practice drill here. Oh, we've got the multiplier up to times four. That one's picked off. I think he dropped that one. Yeah, we're just going to get bronze. It's fine. I'm not going to spend 20 minutes doing the drill to make sure I get gold. Maybe we'll take a look at the team um, real quick. Um, just because it has been so long since I've played. I was focused mostly on Lions franchise there for a while because I think it's going to be my last season on that one. So, um, we'll look at the team. We'll see who we have. Obviously, Malik Cunningham is our quarterback. We've got a fullback, Randolph, Cam Randolph, Cam Randolph. He's got hidden development. It's probably star. I mean, he's a fullback. We've got Ramadre Stevenson and Clyde Edwards Alaire. Got Garrett Wilson, Jamison Williams. I think I'm going to move Trent Boone up. Rashawn Ware is our right tackle. And then Matt Brown. Superstar development as our left tackle. Oh, we've got a pretty good offensive line. Obviously, our tight end, Alex Good. Um, we've got Langford, who I think has the same last name as our guy in um, Brown's franchise.
Josh Uche is injured, so... What are we going to do here? Going to move Bentley to right outside linebacker? Because this is, this is a problem. We can't have like a 63 overall starting at outside linebacker. That looks better. Don't know how much he's actually going to throw. We've got Matt Sharp. We've got Julius Peppers. Christian Gonzalez. I'm going to move Antron Aldridge, who apparently only has star dev. I'm going to move him to uh, CB2. Evan McPherson's here. Langford is our rush D tackle. Um, that's probably not a good idea. I'm I'm gonna leave it though. <laughs> He's got hidden dev. Maybe it's it's something really good. Maybe it'll help him develop. But he's we we may have to change that at some point. Um. We're taking on the Raiders. As I get a drink of my monster here before we start. I'm sure the microphone will pick me pick up me drinking my monster, so I don't wanna don't wanna do that too much, but see what Malik Cunningham can do. Obviously we've got some other good players here, you know. From Andre Stevenson, Clyde Edwards Alaire. That was terrible. I'm used to the meter going much faster. Still should be a touchback. No. Who do the Raiders have here? Looked like they still had Josh Jacobs. But Sam Howe is the quarterback for the Raiders. And we'll go ahead and see who else they have. Um, obviously, Sam Howe, who's starting above Romeo Cosby, who is the backup. Aiden O'Connell all the way down to third string. Josh Jacobs. They've got Matthew McKenzie, who's been here for a couple of years. Del Barrow. Devontae Adams is still here. Jacoby Myers, Hunter Renfro, Trey Tucker. Jaquan Shields. Michael Mayer's still the tight end. Backup is rookie Joseph Kirkpatrick. Offensive line looks pretty pretty good. Not uh, anything. And they've got a couple of good players. Looks like a pretty solid offensive line. D. Hillman. Um, Nichols here at right end. Rookie Dakota McCollum is the backup defensive tackle. Max Crosby's here. Deshaun Little's been in the league for a year. Tyree Wilson is here. Nate Hobbs, not really the best secondary. Darren Cooper, the rookie, full sa uh, free safety. And Isaiah Simmons is on the team at strong safety. So. See how this goes today. <laughs> They don't really have the best record right now either. I think they were two and four. So see how this goes. As Josh Jacobs takes the carry and uh, he he look looks slow to get up there, but he looks like he's gonna be all right. As that was a nice carry. He got a first down on that one. So. We well, may have some trouble stopping the run today. And one thing I do remember from this series is that sometimes we do have trouble stopping the run. So. Patrick Queen already with two tackles. There's a catch. 
First throw there for Sam Howe. Patrick Queen going to be blitzing here. And they're going to run the ball. Already 37 yards for Josh Jacobs. John Franklin Myers going to get the tackle. It's a big loss on the play. Of course, we traded for him from the Jets not too long ago. There's a short pass there from Sam Howe. I'm going to bring up a third and 12 here. And hopefully, we can hold them to a field goal. Sam Howe out of the pocket here. He's going to throw it away. Probably could have had a few yards if he would have just kept running, but he threw it away. And now they're going to take the field goal. The field goal is good. I took a three nothing lead. We'll run this one out. Why not? Only get to the nineteen. And here comes Malik Cunningham. Trying to make the playoffs for the first time this year. 20 touchdowns, 18 picks. 2,300 yards. And if we want to win today, we're going to have to definitely try to limit our interceptions. Which for me is difficult sometimes. What's one way we can limit our interceptions? By running the ball. Clyde Edwards Alaire taking the first carry there. Gonna bring out Ramondre Stevenson. He's gonna get about eight. Seventeen rushes for sixty-four yards last week. And a touchdown. That's not great. Of course that was when we were taking on the Chiefs. Second and two. We're going to throw the ball here, and good looks covered. I'm going to throw it down the field. There's a diving catch by Garrett Wilson. Just an amazing catch there, just laying out for it. Going to run the ball again here. Andre Stevenson going to get another first down. About 10 yards or so on the run. And we're moving right down the field. Throw it underneath to Alex Good. And he's going to get about seven. Like to run the ball again here since we only need about three yards. Andre Stevenson going right through the hole there and picking up the first down. Down to the 16 yard line now. It's another nice run from Ramondre Stevenson. He's got four for 32. They really want us to run levels wide corner, and uh, I think I just want to pick up the first down here and maybe try to get into the end zone on the ground. So we are going to pick up the first down. I wouldn't mind trying to get a passing touchdown here from Malik Cunningham. 
Don't necessarily have to. Wanted to throw it, but uh, we're going to get sacked for a huge loss there. Throwing it over the middle there and nearly picked. Way overthrown. Not, not where I wanted him to throw the ball. Guess we'll go verticals here. As long as we don't turn it over, we can at least make sure we tie the game with a field goal here. Uh, he's going to get hit as he throws. So We'll take the field goal. Evan McPherson going to come out. He's going to get a slow meter there for his... Superstar abilities as I aimed that one, maybe just a little too far. But it is still good. And we have tied the game. As long as we've, we tie it there, I mean, I'm, I'm fine with that. We come away with points. What we don't want to do is turn the ball over. You know, trying to being too aggressive on the after the sack there and uh, then suddenly it's, it's 10 to nothing that's not what we want so glad to come away with the field goal now we just gotta play defense and that's not how <laughs> that's not how we're gonna play defense as Sam Howell gets a big game look, look like it might have been Devontae Adams I'm not, not sure there, but Patrick Queen going to get absolutely ran over there. Julius Peppers is going to make the tackle. <laughs> Patrick Queen just got absolutely knocked forward and, and trucked there. As they're going to take it to the end of the first quarter here. Could have got another play, but <sighs> about one possession for each team there in the first quarter. again here. Seven rushes for 35 yards. Seems to me Ramondre Stevenson ran the ball a little better than that, so I'd love to get him a really good game and eventually get him up to Superstar X Factor, but might need to string a few really good games in a row for that to happen. As the Raiders pick up another first down. Don't usually use it the wrong linebacker, but sometimes if they're blitzing, I will. They're going to pick up five there. Kind of just hoping to hold them to another field goal at this point. Langford going after him, but can't get the sack. Devontae Adams with the catch. Down to the seven yard line. Gonna be a lot tougher to hold him to a field goal now. So it is first and goal here. It's like an RPO. They're only gonna get about a yard on it. Seven for eight so far for Sam Al. That one's incomplete. It's a nice hit on the by the defender there. It's third and goal now. To the end zone. That's a touchdown. Hunter Renfro. Just needed to hold him one more play and we couldn't do it. Uh... They're going to take the lead here. 10-3. Really need to come away with a touchdown on this drive. Abraham going to get us to the 22. 
Holy Cunningham going to come back on the field now. Looks like Max Crosby's in the zone. We're just going to run the ball to the other side of the field and we're run away from him. Six rushes for 40 yards so far for Ramondre Stevenson. And Ramondre Stevenson does have superstar development. He He's developing pretty nicely so far. If we could get him just a few overall points higher, he might really be able to carry more of the load here, but He's going to get stuffed on that one. It's fourth and three at the 29-yard line. And it's probably a real bad decision to go for it here. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get it out to Ramondre Stevenson on the pass. And that's the first down. Touch pass here to Abraham. He's going to break a tackle. End up getting about eight yards there. That is a pass. No. Well, just a little forward flip there by Malik Cunningham. Handed off to Ramondre Stevenson again. He's stopped again. Gonna run it with him again now. Gets real close to the first down, fourth and inches. Um, and I, I'm not gonna punt the ball here. I'm gonna go for a fullback dive with Cam Randolph. And he's going to get stuffed. Absolutely nothing on that play. McElroy got a good push. And the Raiders are going to have the ball at the 49-yard line. Josh Jacobs just stiff-arming everybody. Running people over. And now he's in the zone. That's not what we want. Maybe shouldn't have just tried to hand it off to the fullback, but there's a diving incompletion there. Devontae Adams couldn't hang on. Greenfield chasing Sam Howe. That's going to be a sack by Greenfield. It's going to bring up third and 19. They don't have to snap the ball here before the two-minute warning. But they will. All kinds of time. That one's overthrown. Had, had a uh, receiver there, but... Was overthrown a little. And they've got a good punter, but that one's... Not really a good punt. We're going to get the ball to 24. Plenty of time to try to do something here. <laughs> I didn't have the time I wanted on that Maybe we'll look for Alex Good here. Edwards Alaire on the field now. Launch it down the field for Alex Good. Almost making the catch at the sideline. Now they want us to just run the ball and, and punt? I don't I don't think so. Um We're just going to go the 
of four verticals play here, but we're going to get Malik Cunningham on the outside. He's running the ball. Nearly picks up the first down. And we're going to punt. Not a great punt there by me. Get him at the 29. We've still got all of our timeouts if we can manage to somehow get a stop. That one's incomplete. Sam Howe has uh, cooled off a little bit here since that big first quarter. There's a nice pass, though. And get out to midfield. Really don't want to let him score at all here. Not even a field goal. Throwing it again here. Aldridge on the coverage can't stop the completion. As it's Devontae Adams again. They're going to call timeout now. They're down to one timeout. Apparently, they called one earlier, and I just didn't notice, so. Sam Howell going to get chased and throw it away. We really needed a sack on that play. Sack on that play makes it a much tougher field goal. They lose, you know, 10 or 15 yards. Third and six now. They've got one timeout. And we'll play action here. That one's caught. And they're going to take the field goal. Ran it all the way down to two seconds left there. So. We're going to go down 10 at the half. Dolphins losing to the Bears. That helps us out if we can win this game. I think we'll go run inside. And then... Defend the inside run. It's going to make outside runs better for them, but... I don't know. I feel like our defense is... Probably done enough in this game to really keep us in it. I think our offense just hasn't quite done enough. We had the punt, we had the turnover on downs. Just need to find something here. I've done this a couple of times in Browns franchise where I've run slants and then sent the outside receiver just deep. That time it was almost picked off. Okay. It's going to be third and eight here. Gonna get it to Abraham. That's a first down. 
he was wide open. Get Edwards Alaire back onto the field for a run here. Hopefully we can get some decent blocking. Just gonna get about six. That's that's fine. Just go back to Ramondre Stevenson now. I've really got a a two headed approach here at running back. Stevenson gonna power through. Probably his over the last five or six runs, he hasn't had nearly as much. They kind of figured out how to slow him down, and I, I just think the blocking maybe hasn't been quite as good. Edwards Allaire are going to take that one for seven. Like to try to slow the game down a little bit here. Just keep the ball out of the Raiders' hands. Excuse me. Um, just really try to uh, not let them do a whole lot with the ball. Because we're moving it right down the field here. I think we're going to go read option now. Maybe, maybe get Malik Cunningham involved in the run game. And they're going to fall for that one. Malik Cunningham trying to make a move there. He's only going to get about three yards. <sighs> Maybe we can finally go play action now. Looking for Alex. Good. Near. Oh, it is going to be picked off. Oh, man. Too, too much traffic there. Um, I mean, that's that's where the play is, is designed to go. It's just he it really wasn't open. And now we're down 10, and the Raiders have the ball. Definitely have to get a stop on this drive. We're going to run it there, and it's going to bring up third and two. like to call an audible here we're gonna throw the ball that's caught just a quick throw there still can get a stop on this drive here they're not in the field goal range yet getting close though They stopped Patrick Queen on the blitz. He was headed straight for the quarterback. Picked him up at the last second. Oh, you knew Greenfield wasn't going to pick. You know the defensive tackle wasn't going to get in position to pick it off. It's a 10-point game. A field goal here is not the worst thing. But we, we cannot let them score a touchdown. Touchdown. Makes it a three score game. Down by. We're down by 17. And that just. Does not seem like something we can come back from right now. It's John Franklin Myers going to stop Josh Jacobs. And that's going to knock him out of the zone, too. Langford getting by, but he's going to throw that one out of bounds, pretty much. It's going to bring up fourth and ten now. They're going to kick the field goal. Field goal's good. They've got a good kicker. Holding him to a field goal definitely helps there, though. Still a, still a two-possession game. 
Abraham going to bring up the kickoff here. We still, you know, have plenty of time if we want to keep running the ball. I was hoping Abraham was going to continue his route there across the field and didn't leave me um, as much of any place to go when he didn't, so... There's eight yards on the run by Edward Delaire. Brings up third and two. I think we could just run the ball here. Right behind. I think our left tackle is Matt Brown and then Alex Good. That's going to bring up fourth and one. And I'm going to run the same play again. I'm going to get stopped though. Oh my. We, we needed that, and we didn't get it. And maybe we should have punted, but... And there's a pass to, to Devontae Adams. Is it going to be first and goal? And now we might have to abandon the run, because it's going to be the fourth quarter. Like I said earlier, I thought our, our defense has done enough in this game. but Our offense really just has not been there. If we can somehow hold them to a field goal here, it, it would really, uh, as they score a touchdown. So, uh, you know, forget that. I mean, they're going to go for two, actually. Try to make it a 21-point game. And hopefully we can stop them from getting the two. Because then I feel like maybe we'd still have a chance. But no, they get the two. Of course they get the two. It's a 21-point game. And now we're going to have to look to throw the ball quite a bit more with Malik Cunningham. See if he can somehow save the game here. Down 21 in the fourth quarter. Gets it to Garrett Wilson. It's a first down. Just really haven't thrown the ball a ton today. We tried this earlier. It really didn't work. But we've got Jamison Williams over there this time and not. As we don't even get the play. We're going to try it again, but try to get the ball out a little quicker this time. But we're actually going to just throw it to Alex Good. That's going to bring up a, a much more manageable third and six. <sighs> Alex Good looks covered. I'm going to throw it back across the field to Abraham, and that's caught, and maybe a face mask at the end. What a play from Malik Cunningham. Doing the one thing he shouldn't, throwing it late back across over the middle. but Ends up working out. And we're looking to score a touchdown here. Throw that one short for Edwards Alaire. It's going to bounce off a tackle and pick up about four. We might be able to run the ball here if we can do it quickly enough. Don't get anything, though. Go play action. 
throwing that one to the end zone is picked off. Isaiah Simmons, he's had both interceptions today. And that just might be the game. We're making bad decisions. It's... We, 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 made, <laughs> we needed three scores anyway, but if we would have scored there, it would have been a much closer game as Josh Jacobs going to break free. Five minutes left now. And, and I'm sure they're just looking to bleed clock here. Run the ball again. There's there's just nothing we can do about it. Anything we do is is not working here, so now they're gonna throw. It's incomplete out of bounds. Twenty for twenty eight today for Sam Howe. I think a loss here puts us at two and five on the season, so we may be looking to make some moves at the trade deadline. Which I think will be in the next episode. Will not be in this one. Gotta figure out what I'm doing first, so it's gonna be fourth down. And then the field goal here pretty much puts the game out of reach, I mean. Abraham going to get the return. We have three minutes to score three touchdowns and three two-point conversions. So I'm gonna throw this one deep for Alex. Good, it's knocked down. And apparently, we were ranked number one in passing offense on the season. So maybe we should have th thrown the ball a little more today. Gonna look for Jamison Williams deep down the field. He's gonna make the catch. We're gonna hurry up to the line here. About 20 seconds gonna run off the clock. Try for Jamison Williams again. He's tried to get it. At least the clock's gonna stop at the end of the I, I definitely don't want to run a halfback draw. Like, There's a touchdown, Garrett Wilson. Just think it's a little too late to matter. I think we're probably just going to try to run the two point in with Edwards Alaire. He's going to go right up the middle for two. And I think we kick this one deep. Um. I think we're just going to kick it deep and use our timeouts. We also have the two-minute warning. And you never know. Maybe we can get a turnover. Not real likely. I'm going to go ahead and call a timeout. <sighs> go ahead and use those timeouts before the two-minute warning. They're 
hand that one off. They're going to get a few yards there. It's going to bring up a third and five. They're going to throw the ball. And that one's knocked down. It's going to stop the clock and save us a timeout. And the two-minute warning. Abraham on the return here. Gets a couple of yards. I, I do still think there's pretty much zero chance here that we are able to win this game. So There's a... I don't know. I thought he was going to catch it, but... So drop by Edwards Alaire. He had a he had a shot there. Had his hands on the ball. Just gonna just get that one to Abraham, but he drops it again. It's two drops in a row. Not not by the same player, obviously. But. Now we ran this play earlier, but we went to. Uh, Ended up going to Jamison Williams. I don't think I can get the ball that far down the field, but he's going to turn around and catch it. Down to the 20. We'll hang on to our time now. Looking to the end zone here. That one's picked off, and that's the game. <laughs> any any remote chance that we had left there is, uh, is over. As... They're just gonna take a knee here. It's gonna be it's gonna be the final score. Now we're gonna we're gonna take a timeout. But it's really not gonna matter. Cool. They'll take another knee and that'll end the game. Maybe we should have been more aggressive um, earlier in the game instead of waiting till we were down by so much and then and then trying to be aggressive. But they're actually going to punt the ball here. Uh, not sure why they did, but. <laughs> okay. That's the game. We struggled for most of it. Um, three interceptions from Malik Cunningham. Only threw the ball 25 times. Which is probably, and Ramondre Stevenson, he started out running the ball pretty well, but they figured him out. I mean, they after a while, he just... Couldn't do anything. Maybe we should have ran it more with Edwards Alaire. He had 8.2 yards per carry, but only ran it four times. Tyreek Abraham, three catches, three catches, and a touchdown for Garrett Wilson. Jamison Williams, only two catches, but 100 yards. Alex Good only had two catches. We probably should have just looked to throw the ball more. I didn't look at the defense, but it wasn't good most of the game, so. Rashawn Ware are going to get an upgrade. We'll go power. Plus one pass block power, plus one run block power. Tyreek Abraham's got an upgrade. And I think we go playmaker. It's a ton of upgrades. I think short route running by three I saw there. And we're not going to advance the week. Um... We're going to look and see if there's anything we want to do with the trade deadline to maybe try to bring this team back from uh, from their 3 and 5 record. We got you know, we're about halfway through the season. Anything could happen other than maybe winning the division. The Bills at 7 and 0 right now. So 
But if we can overtake the Dolphins for that second spot in the division, maybe we can make the playoffs. Um, but we'll we'll look at what we're gonna have to do, and and maybe that's something on defense. So I will see you in the next episode when we maybe make some moves at the trade deadline. Um, have a good day.